Hey guys, what's up today? It's the Casual Coder, and in today's video, what I'm going to be showing is the Sharesy's new uh, US shares. So right now, they're in uh, early access or beta testing essentially, so I'll just quickly go into it. So as you can see, there's a couple of changes. So firstly, I've already converted some of my currency into the USD. Um, it's a pretty easy process just to exchange money. So as you can see, I can change from either USD to NZD or NZD to USD. And so at the moment I have uh, $60. So if I wanted to convert that, uh, you can see the rate right now, it's about 0.65. And the amount, the exchange fee that they're charging. So as you can see, Sharesies charges a 0.4 um, percentage. Uh, which is significantly less than like its competitors such as Stake and Hatch um, Which is very good So yeah, as you can see um, if I was to just exchange that I would get that there and I've already done that already So I'm just sitting with $163 So the next change is when you go into invest I'll have a little pop-up showing what the old UI look like, but this is what the new UI looks like so as you can see, it has a recently viewed, has this little learn section, which just adds or puts in information in like a pretty easy to read place. So yeah, these are my recently viewed, and these are all like popular types of stocks, so companies, ETFs, transport, healthcare, etc, etc. So what I'm going to do now is just hit see all. So as you can see here, it offers a lot of different options. I do personally wish they would have gone back to an original form where they just had uh, companies and then funds and then maybe just done that via the US market or the different exchanges. But it is what it is at the moment, maybe they'll change it. So as you can see there's a risk levels all the way up to 7 and let's just see instead of let's see what's on the nasdaq for example so yeah as you can see there's 144 investments available and then if i go into here we've got all your standard companies that are listed on the nasdaq so let's just see if i place a order ah uh, because i only got access today so even i haven't placed an order and uh, let's see, what do I A few moments later. Let's see. Let's see. What? Hmm. Too many options again. And I don't wanna. Uh, let's just see what Nike. So, looks like the UI is more or less the same. They offer stats, risk level, price change. Not much difference there. And a little description and oh this is different so we can see when the New York Stock Exchange is open the hours so as you can see it just opened a couple minutes ago and I'll place a fractional okay so again this is the first time I've seen this screen so we have a market order which is pretty standard okay and they do offer limit orders so limit buy again pretty standard so let's see if I place just a $50 put my password in and you can see right here there's estimated transaction fee of about 25 cents so that's pretty standard as well and then yeah, so if I just hit buy, it, this order would have gone through. And I don't think there's much else that's changed. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see um, in the long term what sharesies will do or where they'll go from here. Whether they'll expand into other markets as well or just expand the amount of ETFs and companies offered. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 
uh, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Straight